Hello Maniacs, this is Hulk of X Maniac and welcome to Friday the 13th the game. So in today's video I'm going to be showing you Adam and the best perks to use Adam and a few tips along the way. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. Okay, so Adam's stats are Composure 7, Luck is 2, Repair is 6, Speed is 5, Stamina is 4, Stealth is 3 and Strength is 8. So in all, Adam is a pretty good character to be fighting Jason and if all else fails, he's a good character to actually do some repairs to get to actually get away. Okay, so the first perk that I'm going to show you is, which I think is good for Adam, is Swift Attacker. Now Swift Attacker basically increases the durability of your weapon which is if you're going to be fighting Jason this is the ideal perk to use the only downside on this perk is that you just take a you take damage a bit more off Jason if he does hack at you now I have got another video which shows all the weapons that you can use on the game and which weapons are the best to use for this character uh, it is worth a watch because you do find out a little bit more and there is a secret little tip in there on that video as well to help you pick the, the right weapons for the job. I will leave a link in the description below so that you could have a look and see which weapons are the best. So my second perk to use as Adam is Sucker Punch. Now Sucker Punch is basically when you hit Jason it will stun him for a long amount of time then then as normal the only downside is it takes a little bit of your sprinting speed so it's basically ideal to have this just so that you could hit Jason and then basically just make a little bit of an, es an escape or for your stamina to charge up a little bit so you don't get don't really get caught out so that is the reason why I use this perk it's a good perk as well. So then my final perk to use is, this one is very important for when you're fighting Jason as well, is Fit Skinned. Now basically Fit skin just gives you a bit more uh, health. Uh, it does take a lot more for Jason to kill you. Now, I actually let Jason hack at me just to see how many it would take for me to die. Uh, he didn't actually kill me, but it took him six hits to actually get me for me to start limping with thick skin dog which is good which is very very good that's what you want for when a Jason starts getting really mad and doesn't can't grab you or and he just starts whacking at you so really enough it's it's an ideal perk to use really if you're going to be fighting Jason or trying to kill Jason so Adam is a is a good character to actually have and now we'll go on to the next bit, which will be tips. So without further ado, here we go. Okay, so one of the first tips I would say for Adam is repairs. If you can, do as many repairs as you can with Adam. Because Adam is pretty good with, with repairs. You can repair pretty quickly and if basically if you are going to go and kill Jason and all else fails, which happens a lot, then you've got a few little repairs to, to get yourself out of there which, to get yourself to survive now the next tip which i think is very important with adam is try and stay with somebody it's just because his luck is ever so low and his weapon will break very very easily and that is what luck is all about I basically use his ba the baseball bat which is for Adam is the strongest one to use and I only swung at Jason twice and it broke so I was a bit like a bit of a deer in the headlights really against Jason and so if, if you had somebody there to back you up you'd be completely completely fine but in a way Adam can can handle himself on his own anyways if there is weapons about so you can give give Jason a little bit of a run around, but I always say always t 
team up with some with somebody if you can. And then my last tip is what weapons to use as Adam. So for the best weapons to use as Adam is the baseball bat, the axe, the machete and the wrench. The perks that you have on you should do pretty fine. So guys that is the end of this video. I hope it's helped you out a lot. Um, these literally don't, don't work all the time. It's not going to get you to survive all the time. It's just what I think is the best for, for Adam. And just another little note that I'm going to add on to okay, here is people, here. let's have our microphones on. Let's get talking to everybody, uh, the counsellors and stuff like that to try and get away. It does help out a lot and, you know, we need you this to happen chance. a lot more for this game. But anyways, without further ado, this is Hulkrex Maniac over and out.